Knox County officials say a Nashville developer isn't holding up his end of the bargain to make the Andrew Johnson building in downtown Knoxville a hotel again. The county now sending a letter to the group asking them to start construction within 90 days or they could lose that contract. Our Jared Austin joins us live from the building on Gay Street downtown. Jared, construction was supposed to start more than a year ago. Yeah, and county officials say ever since then they have not seen any progress being done on this building. However, not the only project that's hitting some snags here in Knoxville. Two of Knoxville's oldest buildings still sitting empty after years of planning. It's important for downtown. The Andrew Johnson building built in 1927 and Standard Knitting Mill. Both are projects on pause right now. Developers for the Standard Knitting Mill tell us they'll start discussing the project again later this year. The city says they can't do anything until the developers come to them. However, Knox County officials taking direct action with the Andrew Johnson building developers. We did a send a letter to Mr. Welker um, asking him to give us uh, basically uh, a plan uh, and how he's going to move forward in, uh, in the next 90 days. Knox County Chief Financial Officer Chris Caldwell says this letter went to them after nothing was getting done in more than a year. We think that now that the um, market has settled down a little bit and so it's time to move and so I think for us it was just Hey, let's get this conversation started on and how we can move forward. Caldwell saying BNA Associates bought the building for six million dollars with hopes of making it a boutique hotel. The county giving developers 90 days to do something. If they don't, developers could lose the contract. We of course don't want to do that, but 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 we will if 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 we don't get a response. The chief financial officer says he does feel confident something will get done. He actually had a conversation with the developers earlier today. They're hoping to have a discussion on this in the next couple days. As for when this could become a hotel, it's supposed to be three years after construction started, guys. But with everything going on right now, they really don't know what that timeline will be. They'll have to rediscuss that as well. All right, Jared, thank you very much. Appreciate it.